guys, if you're at home right now and quarantined like the rest of us, this is a real um, phenomenal 20 minute workout that I'm gonna do right with you right now. So you're gonna need a ball, a mat, and a set of light weights. Let's just do a little bit of a warm up, stretching up. Come on, get off your seats. Don't just watch me, you gotta do it with me. Otherwise I'll feel silly doing this by myself. Roll those shoulders back. And let's just take those knees up, right and left, you got this. There, you do it from the side, you always look skinnier, so I'm gonna stand to the side. <laughs> Keep it up. Now let's take that elbow down to the knee, get a little cross body. There you go. It's so interesting that we have to be at home by ourselves. But not really, I'm even with you. Doing it with you, just trying to all stay in shape together. All right, take that deep breath in, up. And let's do those plank walk -ups. So we're gonna come down to a plank. And right hand up. And left hand up. This helps engage those obliques so that they're ready to work. Nice shoulders, nice core. You got it. And let's try knee to belly. So you're pointing that toe, bringing the knee up, pulling that belly. That's it. You don't even have to have the sound done. You can just follow me doing the exercises and put on your own playlist. There you go. Three, two, and one. Take that stretch from the hamstrings. I love those hands. That's it. And walk those feet in. Bend those knees and roll it up. All right. Let's start with your weights. Because I know you all walk forward, we're going to do some lateral work to start. We're going to take a lunge down to the side. Punch it up. Let's do 15. One. Two. Repeating now. 
Going back into those side lunges, just to the side. Take it down and punch. Make sure the toes are pointing forward, weights in the heel. You're keeping that high arm right next to your ear, straight up. That's it. Breathe through it. Here's a little bonus, you can get the tricep. Woo! Then arm back. Hands at the side. 
side, lift those hips up, pull the belly in, roll the ball in 15. Try and dig the heels into the ball, keeping the toes up to the ceiling. That'll help you work more hamstring and less lower calf. Eight to go. That's it. And five, four, three, two, and one. Right here, little 10, little bonus, nine, eight, seven. Squeeze and lift, six, five, four, three, two, and one. All right, back to the beginning. Remember, we're doing that vertical loading, so we repeat the three exercises in a row. Hands wide, feet wide, and reach. That's it. Ten more. You got it. Seven. Remember, you always have that knee option. Four, three, two, and one. Remember, down to the elbows. You can put the ball behind your calf. Squeezing it in. Belly in tight. Arm out to the side. Twenty. That's it. Keep that heel pressing up into the ceiling. Nice and strong. Woo! Six to go. Four, I got that hand up. Three, two, do you? And one. All right. Going down the other side, elbow down, leg up, hand out to the side, and behind the back. 20. You know, as an instructor, I don't always have to do all of the exercises, but I'm doing them with you now because we're in this together. We're all working out, trying to make a difference, trying to stay healthy, and you got this. Five more. All right. Build a better backside. Build your bottom line. Let's get back into those hamstring curls. Legs up on the ball, heels on, hands at your side, push into the floor with those arms, use the triceps, pull the belly in, 15, that's it, squeeze those knees together, squeeze it together, that's it, 12, 3, Two, hold it, pulse up. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Nice work. All right, grab those weights. We're going on top of the ball. We're going to get the triceps, finish up that chest, and a little bit of core. This is your last series. Look, this workout. It's only about 15 minutes. You got 15 minutes? Get on the ball. We're going to go down so the shoulder blades are only on the ball. So let's start back a little further. Roll it down. Hands up, thumbs together. Overhead, straight arms. So the key to this one is keeping the abs, arms straight, abs tight, and lifting up from the back side. I keep those hips lifted right here. If you um, have heavier weights, or a gallon of milk, or I guess or a baby or a dog, you can use that as your weight. But keep those arms really straight, shoulders down away from the ears, and don't let this pop up, stay connected. Hold it on the angle, triceps. So that was more our lats and triceps working together. This is isolating those triceps. Eight more. You gotta always have at least one woo in a workout video. Try to get home and make it feel good. Say it. Woo, woo, woo. Three, two, and hold it. Bring it over the chest. Take it out to the side. Thumbs up. 
Now, we're just moving in a very small range of motion here, about four inches from the wide tee. Hopefully the backside's getting some good work, keeping the butt up off the floor. You know, we have weights and stability balls if you need to borrow them. Just text me 630 we'll figure out a time to get you over to the studio and pick it up. Because we want you to be able to do the workouts. Five, four, three, two, and one. Now, for our core, you want your hips into the ball, hands behind the head, just curl up and open. The weights are optional. You don't have to have the weights here. Your head's already eight to 10 pounds, but curl it up. Curl it up. We want to focus on flattening out this belly as we curl up. Flatten, exhale, inhale. Using those transverse abdominals to flatten. Then the rectus to bring your body up. Four, three, two, and one. Going back to the waist. Let's get back into those triceps and lats, big muscles of the upper body. They're your support muscles for your posture. Take it over. Now, we want to take this wide. That's going to change the angle a little bit. But it's going to really help you work more into the lats and less into the triceps. And remember, we're not coming all the way up. We're coming to that angle. I'm doing that on purpose. I'm not cheating. You'll see it's a little more challenging. Five left. One, two, keep that booty up. Three, four, last one, and five. Hold it here, now bend and straight. So on this tricep, let's go ahead and turn the arms so the palms and thumbs face each other at the end, getting the whole head of the tricep. And the rotation comes from that forearm. 10, nine, straighten it. You gotta squeeze it to make it work. Five, six, or more. Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Woo! Arms out to the side, getting that last bit of chest work. Pulses. Keep the booty up, don't let it drop. Unless you wanna lift it each time. Oh, I like that isometric much better. Your glutes are a big stabilizer of the bottom of the spine. They help protect the lumbar spine and your low back. So just keep them squeezing. Don't bounce it. You've got 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Close it up. Let's open it all the way for 5. Just to really get full range of motion on that chest. It's a nice little stretch. Open it one more. Send down those weights, rolling it into the ball. Let's crunch it up for 20. Keep going. Focus on drawing the lid. Flatten it out. Exhale. Using those diaphragmatic muscles to help engage transverse. That's your waistline trigger muscles. Four left. Now I know a lot of you have tight calves, 
So let's put those weights down in front. Put your toes on the weights. Stretch forward. And then let's take this to a stand. Feet are on the weights. You just want to stand feeling the stretch in the back of the legs. So let me turn sideways so you can really get an idea of what I want you to go for. Full ball the foot on the weight and then slowly slide down. See where you can hold it. Feel the back of those legs, back of the calves, and then bend the knees so you can get into those shins. Lower those hips as much as you can. Toe is up, heel is down. This is for you, Angela. Nice. And anyone else who has some heel pain. Take a deep breath in. I'm Andrea Metcalf with Hey Five Fitness. Hey, we're in this together. Let's keep our workouts going. You motivate me, I'm gonna motivate you. And we're gonna stay fit, and maybe be even a little bit more shapely at the end of this CBO 19. Thanks guys.